Hello there, my name's Carlo and welcome to another tutorial. Um, this one is going to be based around Maya. This is Maya 2014, released two months ago. Um, and what we're going to be doing today is just teaching you um, shape creation um, using your creative tool and basically using your polygon primitives. So, let's begin. Um, so the first thing we're going to do is try and teach you guys how to make the shape of an ice cream. Which is very simple and it's Maya's basic startup to learning how to use Maya. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to go up to create, down to polygon primitives, and then we want to create a cone. Now, as you can see, there's a cross on the screen with a little side arrow. And basically, what you want to do is you want to left click in the center, hold it down, and then drag as far as you can or the size of your cone. And when you release, the up arrow appears. So just press and pull down. And as you can see, we've created um, a cone. So now, what we want to do now is basically create um, an ice cream top. So what we're going to do now is go to create, same place, polygon primitives, and we're going to go to sphere. Same sort of principle, center of the grid, drag out until your ice cream fills the cone like so and then we have our ice cream like that now to change the views on this all you have to do is hit the space bar and then we get four points for four axes side front top first person so whatever you select you can go into frame with right so okay so in order to get back hit the space bar and you'll be back into 3d mode okay so now when you want to change a deformity on an object you basically select what you want and basically if you click this icon here you can change it into a solid mesh right so so if we come out of that we hold down we can zoom into the object zoom out and we can sort of pan around it as well so um, we basically want to change the look of this ice cream because an ice cream is not grey and basically the colour we've got is basically a default template so what you want to do is you want to right click and then you want to scroll down to assign new material and then click on that this box will appear with some basic templates and the best one to go on is basically a Lambert tool so if you click on Lambert tool it will give you a default colour which your ice cream is at the moment so you want to select your colour and select what colour you want the ice cream to be so in this case, I think we're going to go for a white ice cream, like so. And then we want to change the colour of the cone. So we right click, same scenario, assign new material, we click on Lambert tool, select the colours, and then obviously an ice cream cone is brown. So we want to use this box here to drag and get the best possible brown can for the ice cream. And then job done as you can see this is not in scale so what we want to do is we basically want to play around with the axis panel and just move it slightly so it can basically shape itself like so like that if we click here we can manipulate the shapes of the ice cream but what we want to do is just manipulate this just slightly bigger so we can fit the concept of the ice cream inside the cone Right, so so we basically select the ice cream and then we can pull it out All right so okay so now um, basically if you just basically want to see what it looks like you can go down to view and then basically you can come here and you can set the camera settings frame rate and stuff like that all these new green features are the brand new features of the amazing um, Maya 2014 um, and basically when we want to render it out and just basically see what we're doing um, we basically just go to the render settings and just set it all out but this has also got some very good features for special effects in it as well um, which are preloaded special effects I can just grab this if I want drag that here and put a little plant next to my ice cream and then we can go here and we can make little bushes around your ice cream as well even though that's so not relevant to what we're doing but I'm just showing you the new little bits of Maya 2014 
so basically I hope this has helped um, teach you guys you know how to make basic shapes using Maya um, and please subscribe and um, I'll be back soon for another tutorial <laughs>